Well, normally this would be an introduction to my random DC, but sadly he's ill, so if so, me and Kara decided to press on without him. But this is a more important episode here, so welcome back to Resident Evil here on the RTK channel. With myself, the Heavy Bits X, with Kari Okami in the background, and the evil fox thing called Jimmy Kari. You better give me a reason to speak, do you? Sorry. He's always like that. He's a bad minion. I'm not a minion. Minion. No! Spiders! <laughs> yeah, this is the first time we take on the spiders. These are bloody huge enemies, don't gonna lie, so... I freak out about a large spider in my bathtub, so if I saw a spider like that, I would grab the nearest thing and start bashing it. Even, even though that spider's probably as big as your bathtub. In fact, that's bigger than- I, no, 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 I, I have a violent reaction towards spiders. If I see one there, I kill it instantly because I know it's going to come back later on. Aye. Do you know the worst thing is? That spider is twitching its death rose. You really look at that? It's just like... Ugh. Well, I told, I told some people... Do you know the worst thing is? There's a giant spider boss <laughs> later on in the game. God. I know. I, I you probably hate me right now. <laughs> Considering the fact that I broke my Guitar Hero's controller just by smashing a spider against the wall That's... and it dropped down in front of me. Bloody! <laughs> yeah, I think I'll be fine. Right. Anyway, we just went to that optional room here just to pick up the uh, freaking the ink ribbons and the uh, clip for no bloody reason. We just don't need. Them. Yeah. Why do you need the ink ribbons again? To save, right? Ink ribbons are essentially for saving. Without those, you've got nothing. Oh, so it's like saving tokens. So instead of unlimited saves, you. Right. Yeah. You know those type. You know those typewriters that we've had for most. Yeah, of I got. I got confused and wondered why you kept on collecting them. I knew they had something to do with saving. Yeah, but... and they're the important thing because they are saving. Anyway, going to this first room, this is 001, you get, uh... Oh, look! It's, um... Dick Van Dyke. Me? Me? Oh. Yeah. By the way... Mm. He... Helsing920 has started watching our vids. Admittedly, he wants to know why he is like the snake. He wants to know why he's the snake. Well, you could ask James for that bitch, because he, he's the one that mentioned the, um... He's the one that mentioned the whole, um, Hellsnake 920. Well, why not? Because he's essentially a more famous YouTuber, so... Ember, mm. If Emma's watching this, it's, it's not... You're, uh, well, what can we just say? You're... You're our friend. You're a big guy with a big mouth, like a snake. Yeah. And you also spit venom at people when you get annoyed at them. <laughs> also, also, reaction review. Yes. Anyway, this bathtub is full of muddy water. We need to unplug it. No, seriously. Please. It looks like acid. It kind of does. Um, not really. It's, it's muddy water, I mean. Or sewage. Ew. Anyway, get pick up this first item, which is the control. I would not touch that if that was in the dirty bathtub. I'm sorry. Well, the, essentially, there's like a toilet there. Oh, interesting. By the way, we're in the we're in the uh, second area of the game. This is the guard house. This is where all this is where all the Chibikari's minions hang hang out whilst they're not working for her. Essentially, it's like big minions. Then why don't you stay there? Until I summon you. Exactly. Eh, let's get through. Let's go through this. Bad minion, bad. Yes. Bad minion, bad. Anyway, moving on. We're into this next part here, walking through this area. It's not much zombies in this bit so far. Matter. Didn't you kill them all earlier? I killed three of them, so... Yeah. yeah this is probably the back. Uh, in this bit area here, you pick up the key, but there's also that you need to avoid this because there are wasps. Speaking of which, that's a wasp! Run! By the way, they'll poison you. Run! Note as well, there's a room inside that bit there. It's kind of optional as well. But you need to. You, but it's essentially that we have to take it out because there's a um, big massive plant here. It's an infamous. It's an infamous boss called Plant 42. You'll probably find out the reason why, but if you uh, if you use the, there's a room that actually makes the stuff. 
lethal like a freaking yeah. bee jolt. You can you you can go underground to kill the to uh, effect, effectively essentially weaken the creature. So what you also need to do here is there's not much room is there, but there's also another sub boss as well, which is stupidly infamous. So there's a spider sub boss. There's there is a plant sub. Boss. There's a plant boss, a spider boss, and there's a shark boss. Yes, it's called yes. The shark boss is called the Neptune. Yeah, let, let, let me just pro let me just essentially process that for a moment. Seriously? Yeesh, indeed. So yeah. Uh. All right there. Huh? You all right? I'm just amazed by the stupidity of them for the um, Neptune. Yeah, that, that's the such what the uh, freaking umbrella people called the freaking shark guy. So yeah, it is uh, uh. Neptune. So let's take. So we have another zombie. Here and he's dead. A lot of bathrooms in this guardhouse. <laughs> yes, there are a lot of bathrooms. It's only about three dorms anyway. Which is this is the second one. So we're about to go under we're about to find another actually a secret room that takes you to the underground. So we finally find a map here. For some reason it's in this one. Another desk lock, so if you use the lockpick here, this contains more shotgun shells. Because trust me, shotgun shells are gonna be very useful later on. Oh yes. And now you're gonna pick up the map. The dormitory squared, yeah, this is a this is the map of the dormitory. AKA the guardhouse. You see, I like it when they have games where they kind of hide items, make key items blend in with the background. I it, it helps. It, and now we, it makes you actually properly look for it. Right, now we get to show the effectiveness that is of not effectively plant Point for Plant 42. Essentially, it's been corrupted by the T virus. It is a tyrant virus. What it does here is it's basically either it goes through the nutrients or it just grabs people and sucks out their blood. <laughs> so why did I'm just wondering? I don't mind. I don't mind the plant that essentially does that. Plant sucks up blood in order to get um. And most of the uh, most of the people that are in the, the uh, guardhouse, they're the ones that have fallen victim. How devious is GB Kari when it comes to making plants? I don't. Know. I'm not very good at gardening. Really. I first thought it would be much bigger, and you would have big roots that went all over the world, so you would have them pop up randomly. You are scary. If when you get a green thumb, you're scary. Anyway, we're underground now. This is the underground, uh, secret underground. Um, yeah, thingy. Not really secret. If it's very obvious where the stairs are. Well, hidden pair of stairs. But of course, this is a this is where the nip. This is where the underground segment of the whole um house is. So what you need to do here is you need to push these boxes in order to create the bridge. This is full of water right now. No, really, it is. And might I add as well, this is the most complete drawn out puzzle. Because you're gonna push this crate up here, then you'll go around the section, and then you gotta push the crate back, push the crate here, and then we got to push the crate all the way down the level. Might I add as well, this is fucking painful. Just watching this for a good, ooh, I don't know, say minute and a half. This is basically every day of your life. Why at you? <laughs> I think this is probably one of the flaws this game has, was the amount of um, pushing the... Well, the amount of drawing things out, pushing things... Pushing things, solving puzzles and all that. They le they pretty much lessen the whole uh, crate pushing thing in the sequel. It is crate one in the sequel. That's not as bad. Now we're going to go through water. Welcome to the underground facility of this guardhouse. 
that's all flooded, it, which is why Chibi Curry can't go in there. Exactly. This is also probably the reason why Chibi Curry can't go up against this particular enemy. Just, oh, really? And now we get to show off. <coughs> Here comes a cutscene. This, of course, is the Neptune, a giant shark that's essentially, you know, covered by the T virus. So now we use the control room key, which is useless now. Chuck away, get out of the door, go inside the room before we get nubbed up and munched on by the shark. So we go into the third room now. Go now, head over here. See the flashing lever? Push it down. And Chibikari now gets down to that Chibikari now has a natural element of advantage. No more water, which means she cannot get soaked no more. Nope. So let's now we push this button here. Very important that we do. The sound from the next door, which we had to. So we can all go next door. Uh, more importantly, if we push this button we can uh, find we can get the final key. See all the water's gone. Which means that the that the pit the oh, fuck I lost my train of thought. I was gonna say is that why couldn't you just go there despite the water? I mean, he's still afraid of getting her hair wet. Well, considering the water was up to fr up to freaking waist, I think it would be more fine. The dormitory key here, this this is the last one that you need, which is essentially dorm key three. Also, you get two casing, two shotgun, uh, case, sh two shotgun boxes, which is cool, and two get two more clips. Uh, that's all that you can get in this bit. For Chris, for Chris's game, shotgun shells are the essential items needed. He doesn't get the fancy items that Jill gets, like the bazooka and all that. So that's for the case there, and. <laughs> Oh, poor fishy. Poor fishy. In other words, Chibi Curry is not din. Chibi Curry can have din din. Din din time. Today is roach is roast Neptune. I don't like tea. I don't like tea virus in hand and noms. You're not doing a very good job of impersonating her. I can't help it. She's very difficult. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No. Yeah. You're mad. And that's why you can't do it for me very well. Try explaining that to James. He seems to pull it off decently well. Okay. Uh, moving straight on, we can now head back down this road. We can, uh, we can now take a look at that. We got three rooms remaining. Uh, you see the one with the L, which is near the big one, which is like the curved L, reverse L. That's where we need to go. Mm. That's where we need to go. That's the last dormitory key. Uh, that room there it contains a lock, padded lock. But the only way to do so is to go to the um, is to go through the spare room that we went with the spiders. Yes, Kari. It, it yes, Kari. The one with the giant spiders. I didn't. I didn't say Chibi Kari. Chibi Curry's not. She doesn't like spiders either. Why the fuck do you not like spiders? It's just like eight leg, very eight legs. You hate. You, probably, you hate. You hate Josh. Then he's got like a tarantulas. Oh, don't get me started. Tarantulas. Big hairy. One of my friends of their mum has a pet one. Domesticated spider. Yep. How the fuck can you domesticate a fucking a fucking spider? What are you supposed to do? Give it flies? No. Eh, don't know either. Anyway, we're saving the uh, next. We're saving the confrontation with the big, huge, giant plan for the next episode. We're hoping that the other, with the third member of our Patriots, will be will be will be well enough for it to take out, for, for to be well, you know. Yes, we hope that the third member of our brigade will actually be able to join us next episode. Exactly, because it's like that we get to take on the giant. That was so hard to stare at, was it? <laughs> You're doing a good impression of Emma there. I am. Um, I. Uh, I. I don't know, uh, Kari. Um, I don't know. That was not Emma. That he's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill both. Of us. I know he's gonna kill the both of us. 
mentioned freaking, you know, we mentioned him twice this series. Not to mention three a times. Three times now, so. This video, the snake, and the skirt. Yeah. I think you. Oh well. Until next time, dear viewers. We will see you in the near future. Bye for now.